pretty big day here at the ranch. We got the guys here that are doing some plowing and fertilizing so that we can get our coastal fields up and running. Check them out. They've got two giant machines, two giant tractors with all their implements, and they're absolutely going to town. They'll have this thing done in no time. Try them a little bit. Blue seemed a little bit better, but we're gonna still give him a few more days off, let him fully recover. Uh, today we're just gonna get smoke ridden and get on him. And we're supposed to have a nice little day today for some sunshine and then the rest of the week and the weekend is just gonna be really, really wet. So good thing for our hay because we just got all the hay planted, but not so much when you're trying to ride. so far I'm a man of all the cameras today I got the vlogging camera and the uh, content camera if you will gonna get some horses worked it's a beautiful day a while back I mentioned that we had changed plans for the arena originally it was over there by the main house but now it's gonna be all over here um, basically we've got a really long narrow strip with good footing right here to clean off a little bit to make sure that we can get it exactly where we want to bring in some bays bring in some sand and uh, this will make the nice training spot that we want how Maddie gets some of her shots, just like that. All right, we're heading back to the barn. Okay, we got all the seeds down the other day. We got a good little rain last night, so we got the fertilizer supplied right now. And Charlie's on the tractor getting it put down, so we're gonna get the drone up in the air and check it out.
other day when those boys came and they uh, planted all the seeds. I was going to try to get some shots of the seeds to just show you what it looked like, but they honestly came so fast and had it all done in such a hurry that I couldn't even break the camera out. <laughs> just couldn't get to it. So, But I did want to show you what the fertilizer looks like. I don't have any idea what he ordered or what it is, but as long as it makes the coastal grow, I'm good with it. Yep. There it is. If anybody knows what that is, let me know because I would be very interested in knowing exactly what all goes into it. Obviously, I'm not that good of a coastal farmer. Here's a spray. Yeah, okay, so that's what. It's just a chopped up bale of hay. Right. Huh. So they just they, they put it, they go, they go dig it, and then they chop it up, and then they just put it in, back in the ground. No kidding. That's it. Okay, well that's news to me because I thought it was actually like seeds. Oh, here's another one. See, just that little thing right there. That might sprout. Man, it'd be, it'd be, it's probably big enough. But it was spreader. This is a sprigger, they call it. Well, this one here. Oh yeah. yeah. So that already started growing. Yeah. A lot of times they do it before the before the grass starts growing, you know, underneath. It's just dormant. Right. But in the end, you, know, you need to you get another freeze after doing this. It's not good. Yeah. Well, I don't think we're going to get any more freezes. No, News to me, obviously I'm not a very good coastal look farmer. Look at, look at this out here. Oh, yeah. See, I'm like this one, this one, this one definitely should come back. Yeah, and they all got kind of bunched up. Yeah. Bunched up together. Oh, yeah. And it's, 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 it shows it's probably just like a potted plant. Right. They start to wither and look like they're going to die, and you give them a little water. A little bit of moisture, and they come right back. And they come right back. They not have a lot of competition. Right. And that's that's the purpose. That's one of the two purposes in plowing. Mm-hmm. One is to turn up all those plants where they'll die. They'll die. Right. And then the other one is to prepare the soil so, yeah, yeah, yeah. so he can go and get, get these planted at least three inches deep. So by September, if we get good rains, this will probably be about half green. Right. Um, and you'll probably have, we'll probably have to have some herbicide. Yeah. Over here. Like you can see, like just underneath here, you can see this one. Yeah. Yeah. And that one's good. Yeah. That may be part of that. Some of it's uh, potassium. They you do soil, soil tests, right? And you, you send them all to A and M. It just depends on you know you do different different parts of the of your ranch, right? Require different different uh, types of fertilizer and, and. All right. Well, just to summarize what we did for the coastal planting, we plowed up the dirt, then we planted the sprigs, or actually we had somebody else plant the sprigs. And then we fertilized and we watched it grow. So pretty easy.